I've been in and around motorsport, mostly as a competitor myself for years and years and years. I've always been very passionate about it but, you know, for, at every level. It's part of a sort of bigger strategy we've been working on with Paul Jackson and Mike Quaith to build a, a small motorsport group that's suddenly becoming a larger motorsport group and to now have the opportunity to, to expand the group that we've now started and provide all the services and ancillary businesses uh, is, is a great opportunity and a very exciting time. It's been a while coming but I'm really excited about it obviously. It, it really all initially started with uh, Claudio Barro who used to be my boss um, in Italy when I raced for Peugeot. He rang me and said maybe there's an opportunity to come and see me and it's really evolved from there and then I got Andy involved and then Andy got Paul involved and it's just progressed from there to us sitting here now. We spoke to a number of other manufacturers if you like but if you look at it where Lotus is going take away if you like my relationship with Claudia but if you look where Lotus is going as a group they really are out there and you know they they, they want to get there and, and they're putting a lot of money and effort behind it we wanted to be part of that at the beginning so we can grow with Lotus if you like it's the first step uh, but it's a good one and then from here we can then like I said before to develop with Lotus to grow with Lotus take care of some of their other programs as our team take care of their other programs. That's really where we want to be. And I, I think access to the to the Lotus engineering, the Lotus R&D, and in fact the Lotus facilities at Hetherlin, including the test track of course, so you know, all of those things really give us an extra strength to the bow and make us sure that we can deliver what's needed. I've done a lot of racing, so I have a, a good understanding, if you like, from the racing, from the driver's point of view, looking after the young kids that are coming in and hopefully will race with us to help them as well. I mean, I've compete, competed at Le Mans four times, so I think as a team I'd love to go back to Le Mans. That's, I think, our long-term objective is that we want to represent Lotus at Le Mans. I think I've always come from the school as well, that if something looks good, it is good, and I think the Avoras are such a yeah. pretty car. It absolutely looks right as it sits there now, so, you know, we've got a great starting point, haven't we?